Do you know where fat actually goes to when we burn it? You might think it just disappears, but because of the laws of physics and matter, that's just not possible. It actually goes somewhere, but it may not be where you currently think it goes. A lot of people think that we poop it out or it's turned into muscle or something else, or that it just disappears into the ether, but none of these things are true. You actually exhale the fat as you break it down biochemically and use it for fuel. British researchers teamed up and did some research and published this in the BMJ. They actually used this very impressive looking chemical formula to describe what actually happens to the fat that you burn. Matter can neither be created nor destroyed. So all those carbon atoms and oxygen atoms and hydrogen atoms, they gotta go somewhere. So let's just take one pound of triglycerides, which is the most common fat in the human body. This one pound of fat during the process of ketosis as you're burning it up, you'll inhale 2.9 pounds of oxygen. Then your body does some magic, which we all learned about in biochemistry or physiology class, and you'll wind up producing 2.8 pounds of carbon dioxide, which you effortlessly breathe out when you're breathing. And you'll also make 1.1 pounds of water, which your body can either use, this is called metabolic water, or you can urinate away or pass away in a bowel movement mixed with feces, plus the energy that your body uh, produced with all these chemical reactions. So the next time somebody asks you, what happened to that fat you got rid of? Now you can tell them, I breathed it out. This is Dr. Barry. I'll see you next time.